Okay, so maybe this wasn't such a good idea at all to let people on my stream pick loadouts for me. You see, one particular viewer called Geist put out a contract I had to fulfill, and I regret taking it. But on the bright side, I now have a story to tell. It's a story about creativity. Okay, got the kill. But also about the breaking point of the human mind. Ah! God damn it! It's a story about suffering, about madness. What did I do? Wow. Um. No. I clicked the wrong button. And ultimately, about perseverance. Ladies and gentlemen, the title of this contract was Concertina Bombs Only. In order to fulfill the contract, four requirements had to be met. 1. The equipment allowed are four Concertina Bombs. 2. You have to run solo versus trio. 3. You have to make at least one kill using Concertina Bombs. And finally 4. Get out with a bounty. And in this video, I will share with you what I learned through this ordeal. Aside from the fact that I have a very high threshold for pain and a knack in finding the address of people who fear retribution. But I digress. One thing I already knew is that the concertina is best used for area denial. You can block entrances and exits and that's what it's mostly used for. If you're good, you can lead people to where you want them to go and then take advantage of the situation you created. But since I had to actually kill somebody with this... Well... My first attempt was to set a trap, wait for people to fight and then just cash in on the chaos. You know, throw a concertina at some unsuspecting peasant, grab the bounty, and run. There is a... There is a guy, I'm just trying to get to him, okay? Hello? Oh, Jesus. Oh god, I need a weapon! Of course that didn't work. But maybe I was just in a bad spot, so I tried again. And I have to say, my sneaking skills became top-notch the more I tried to succeed with this challenge. Stay. This is good. Stay. Don't, don't, don't look at me. Stay in that position, please. A little bit longer. Yes, that's good. Oh, shit. Nice! I killed him. Okay, now I just need a bounty and I need to get out. Grab his weapons and murder everything? I can't. I'm not allowed to pick up any weapons before I don't have the bounty. Unfortunately. He doesn't see me. He's going over to rev his partner, and this is exactly what I need! Ah! Fuck! No! Please, no! This is too good! Don't do this to me! Fuck! Okay, I'm in. I think. Oh, fuck. Did I kill her? Did I kill her? Please tell me I killed her. Please tell me I killed her. 
<laughs> but as you can see, there were still some intricacies I had to learn. For instance, we know that just one concertina doesn't do the trick, so you need two. But it gets very difficult to throw another one in because the wire is now a real object in the world, which means the next concertina you throw might not be a direct hit, which means your target survives. I really need them to banish first. before I do anything else. That's good. Kill him. Well, I think I'm gonna die again. Trap them. Please die. Please do me the favor. Ah! Shit! Also, one more drawback is that the ready time before the throw takes forever, and you can't actually throw that thing pretty far in the first place. So you better hit on your first try, or you just get rushed down. That was inside. He's right there. Right there. I just need one kill. Also, the mechanism you pull can be heard over a long distance, so nobody is really surprised when you pull out one of these in a dead silent atmosphere. So many people. So yeah, I tried to retain all of that information, but before I did that, a viewer gave me a very simple idea. Why not treat the concertina like a knife? A heavy blow should be able to secure the kill, right? You're beginning to feel like a concertina god. Nah. A concertina sloth. Like I just want to make it work, just once. Like, do you know the feeling when, you, when you've when you already gotten so close? So fucking close. Of course you want to go one more round, because you can do it. There are people. Over there. Three. Again. I think, ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. Oh, Jesus, they were going through the water. Why would they do that? Thank <laughs> you. 
I hit him. I'm still bleeding. Fortunately, I know where a medkit is. It doesn't kill. It doesn't kill. It does kill. I just didn't hit right. And even if you make everything right, even if you have the right angle, the right bait and the right approach, bad luck can still screw you over so goddamn hard. Take your time. And let's go. Please come over here so I can kill ya. I wish I had a gun. I wish I had a gun. Hello. Somebody else is coming. Somebody else is seeing me. Oh. Somebody else is coming from there, too. <laughs> and sometimes everything goes your way, and it's just your own damn fault. I have my kill. Good, now I just need to get out. You fool. Ah! I'm an idiot! I am a fucking idiot! Why am I doing this?
but there will be a point in time when everything starts to click. I learned from every single mistake I did, so I give you the one match that finally redeemed me for all my effort I put in. Uh, okay, we got the clue, and I think the assassin will be at Ironworks, maybe Fort Karmic. It's here. It's here. Also, Horsey can't shut up. Okay. Game as usual. Game as usual. Last rage. Okay, so I blocked this and this. People could come from Fort Carmack, they will probably come from there. Keep in mind that it's just most likely that people will come from the fort, and here's why. I started at Wolf's Head down here, and nobody started with me, which means all the other people must be somewhere else. Now let's say another team started at Brickworks, and they take the first clue. Then, based on what the first clue did to the map, they might want to push into Fort Karmic because you can get two clues at once there. So, based on that, I figured they would walk in a straight line towards me. And also, I excluded everyone who might be in the other zone, since the map was split. So... Best place to hide? In here. I hate it when the game does that. Told ya. They're coming from Fort Carmack. Now all I need to do is follow my plan, which I don't have. Hope they didn't hear that. It should stick, right? Two kills. All I need now is to get away. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see me try out crazy loadouts, then please visit my stream on Twitch. I also play a lot of other interesting games, and also people tell me that I'm quite funny when I'm not trying to be, so that may be worth checking out? Either way, thank you for watching, and see ya!